Yeah, I just wanted to piggyback on all of the importance that comes up with the informed consent issues. Um, I often see people who, because there's such a, a backlog of therapists to do some of the mental health therapeutic support, I often see people who have already engaged in some sort of, and this is again with youth, who've already engaged in some sort of medical um, intervention. And so one of the things I do is I just kind of, I'm sitting with the youth and their parents and I say, oh, well, so tell me more about what you know about that medical intervention. And kind of like what Dan was saying, you know, children and young adolescents, we wouldn't really expect them it's kind of a developmental, it's out of their developmental range sometimes to understand the extent to which some of these medical interventions are impacting them. And so I think I, I try to kind of do whatever I can to help them understand best, they, best I can. But what really disturbs me is when the parents can't tell me what they need to know about a medical intervention that apparently they signed off for and so i think informed consent has to happen very differently for parents than it has to happen for children and early adolescents and adolescents but it needs to happen and it needs to be a process and and i think therapists are in a really good position to do that process because we have a lot more time with our people than like the 20 to 20 minute medical appointment the way that the and that's another problem is the way the medical system works is is there's often very little time so i think it's really one of our roles is to really do that and to really suss that out and take quite a bit of time to do that and it's more than just like we certainly provide information but then you kind of have to listen to what the the youth is doing with that information to to kind of not not catch them but to pick up on the ways that they're not really understanding what, because they'll say they understand, but then they'll say something else that makes you think, oh, they didn't really understand that they that they are going to have facial hair, right? Because they say something else that makes you think, oh, they didn't get that point, but they'll say they totally get it. 